Greetings and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Dungeons. And here we are at the Crystal Throne for the second time. Because, well, there was a little bit of mechanical mishap during the first recording and let's just say I'm gonna blame Mr. Sidekick for accidentally not putting the microphone jack in the right place. Causing the X story to forget with which way to record my voice. But, luckily, I'm only recovering from a cold right now, so my voice is nice, husky and deep. But I will apologize in advance if I sniffle and cough a bit. Because, well, that's just... that comes with the territory. In any case, here we are at the final mission of the campaign. And we are so close to kicking Calypso in the butt and take back our throne because it sits so comfortably on the crystal. I assume. Why else would you be coming back there for? <sighs> anyway, the challenges we have before us is to collect 50,000 gold, kill both dungeon lords for no discernible reward, achieve a prestige value of 5,000, right? and collect 50,000 soul energy. And the rest of these are just optional stuff. Alright, let's get into it. Most of these quests, by the way, are really just there to waste time. You can beat this level at quite early on. If you don't want to feel like doing these for just the points, don't. But let's begin. Darn Mr. Sidekick. Why did they feel the need to ur the urge to clean the computer of all the dust that had collected since the move? <laughs> Admittedly, it was quite a bit of dust, but still. Master, it is time! Today you finally exact your well-deserved revenge! I hope you've already thought of a few suitable punishments for Calypso. <laughs> yeah, put her in the same room with you so for a few there years. You are. I must say I'm surprised by how far you have come. I expected that you would be as incompetent a dungeon lord as you were a lover. At any rate, this is where your journey ends. My loyal subjects, the ones who have just taken you in a pincher, will have their fun with you. What should I say, Master? Um, maybe, uh, go get him, Tiger! I do not see how being a dungeon lord and being a lover are anywhere remotely the same skills. I mean, do you build rooms for your lover and hope that someone else wanders in so you can kill them for your lover at any point? Never mind, though. Let's begin the game. And let's play. For all the marbles. As long as I have some left. I mean, granted, I may not have any since I play this game. I mean, it's, it's not terrible, but it's certainly not one of the great games of all ages. That ship has pretty much sailed. Uh, I only have imps. That's not necessarily useful. I need better minions. I mean, imps are good at killing adventurers, uh, but that's not necessarily what I want. Also, I don't have much space yet in my dungeon. Now, <coughs> right. Let's capture some more space, shall we? Let's let us enlarge our view. Now, we get pretty much infinite resources to deal with whatever comes into the dungeon. So I'm not really worried. Uh, the main concern is really setting up the various uh, libraries and equipment rooms. Uh, so that you can uh, handle whatever the heroes want. Uh, well here we have a large weapon. Master, 
Your opponents are planning your destruction and sending a number of their henchmen out to get you. Yeah, that is indeed what they'll do. Something I cannot do. We also have a stone lectern. Uh, look, if they want to do that, I'm sure they can, but... It's not really effective. As long as I'm within my own dungeon domain, none of the enemy's uh, minions can hurt me. Now, that's not to say, of course, that uh, this will eventually overwhelm me, of course. Because it will. Right. Now, I will need uh, some dungeon material. But I should hopefully soon have enough uh, soul energy and prestige to build something nicer and bigger. I've done I don't have much need for gold, but I will want to uh, get closer to that particular area so I can capture this uh, spider hatchery. And I will want to push out. Find all the dungeon entrances and entrances, and all the gateways where the he heroes come in, so that I can more effectively assume uh, resume with the crushing of their souls. Uh, let's see. Uh, no, 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 no. Let's get the torture bench as well. I don't think I will get many heroes to maximum level yet, but actually that's a terrible place for that. Let's put that a little bit further into the middle. And there's plenty of prestige objects uh, hidden here and there. that you will want to capture at some point. The ultimate goal is of course to get over here to the stairway down. But that's for later concern. Right now we need to just defeat the uh, opposing uh, dungeon lords. Make sure that we have eyes on everything. Also I think I have quite enough things I can set this up. So this is essentially my killing area. Which while admittedly not being terribly efficient, is also not the worst thing I've done. Let's see. I can't tell if this is mine. I'm just going to assume that it isn't. So I'll just make it mine. Uh, in any case, the enemy uh, dungeon lords will be trying to, well, essentially kick me out. Which I'll have to discourage them from. But I'll have I have a little bit of time to set up. Just there's only minor heroes coming in, and I will want to open up all the heroes' entrances to maximize the amount of hero input. Master, you are under attack. Sure, I am. A new entrance well, has you? been opened. All right. And this gateway needs to be opened. Also, I need more goblins. Now, I will need to keep an eye out on whatever some of these uh, dungeon lords are doing, because there is a chance they will be able to get passed by uh, my monsters. 
Mostly these monsters are just here to delay. Alright, I think I have access to the spider demons now. <coughs> <coughs> Isn't it fun? Now, uh, let's focus on actually getting things done, shall we? I just need to get lots of prestige and soul energy, so let's let's focus on doing that. Do I have any heroes yet? Nope. Did I open this up yet? Let's go. Also, I may want to extend this library a bit. Alright. Back to the safe zone. Let's take care of this, uh, this would-be champion. After all, I do have several to kill, and I should probably fill in these points before I forget. Points at this point make no real difference in winning or losing. Uh, yeah, might as well improve the pentagrams. Right, she is getting up there nicely, but she is getting in entirely the wrong direction. Alright, stomp you. Yeah, she's gotta keep healing up. Oh, fight, fine. You die first. You die first. Give me some soul energy and then get carried off to prison. Yeah. Our first catch of the day. Alright, that's gonna keep coming in. Uh, let's see. Now there is, of course, a bonus quest to not have any heroes in your dungeon at all. That is stupid. That defeats the entire purpose of the game. Game. Do not make me do such dumb things. Right, we have some Master, assassins. you are under attack. You have opened a hero's entrance, yeah, Master. Sure. Now, the, the division of the class distribution in all the gateways, as far as I have seen, is pretty much equal across the board, so there's not really any special way to prepare. There's also no real need to. So just focus on doing what needs to be done. Uh, I would like a few more sophisticated traps. But I currently do not have the prestige to do it. Right, so far, so far the enemy does not seem to have the presence of getting passed by traps and monsters, which is good. Very good. Alright, let's start expanding a little bit, because there will be heroes coming from over here, so I might as well prepare for that. Now, there's of, of course a little bit of a danger that heroes may be able to get away from me, if they get satisfied in their needs. That is just something I'm gonna have to take for granted. Because I need all the heroes to become nice and fat and juicy. Like cows. Or pigs. Pigs is probably a more apt comparison when talking about humans. Uh, in any case, one of your monsters has just killed a hero. Here we have some tryhard coming into my dungeon. I think it's time to start uh, sending the clear message that this will not do. This will not do at all. This is my dungeon. You roam here at my pleasure. Right. 
that's still being dug. Duck, 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 duck. Hey, you. I live here. Hey, ESL GTFO. Okay, thanks, bye. Alright, let's start capturing solve by old dungeon. Or some new dungeon. And some extra prestige objects, because all of this is nice and juicy. And I've almost already conquered more than enough. Alright, let's take on this, uh, this worm. After healing for a bit. After healing for a bit. Don't worm as a stun ability. That's fine though. The cooldown of these uh, of the convert pentagram spell is annoyingly long in certain considerations. A monster just tore one of your heroes apart, Master. Well pity, tell him not to do it again. And all of a sudden I have extra runes. Alright, let's tear up these imps. Now, of course, this has a uh, very detrimental effect on his ability to defend from my attack. Since taking his prestige you away makes him goblins, weaker. Master. Well, that's not good. You lost one of your goblins, Master. Now, what are they doing then? Stop them. One of your goblins has died. One of your goblins died, Master. No, I'm not gonna go push back here, even though this is and clearly my interest, so his heart must be close by. Should I stop killing by You lost one of your goblins, Master. Well, what are they doing then? Don't tell me they're stupid enough to try and come for me. Alright, this is my place now, Sunny. Now at least he is smart enough to realize that he must retreat. He's not quite smart enough to realize that there is no place you can go to where I cannot find you. Alright, let's let's set up a little bit of a library on this side. Couple of bookcases. And some objects to make it a little bit more regenerative. Now this is way overkill on what you need for regenerative power in the library, but screw it. It looks pretty. It looks pretty. Very pretty. Right, you can serve 1100 per hero. You have. Um, I don't mean to disturb you, but uh, you're under attack! Yeah, well, uh, I'm not dying yet, so it's fine. Right, where am I? Alright, I was here. Crushing fools. No. Yeah. The easiest way to stop this all is to, well, essentially take over this dungeon efficiently, effectively, and right now. Stompy! I said stompy! And I got it. Stop detaching that! I worked hard to get that ability. I worked somewhat hard for that ability. And I wish he would stop doing that. But at the very least give me the ability to do that. But that's the end of this episode. Thank you all for watching.
See you all next time.